school districts in our area are starting the new year off with new safety measures in place. Laurel County and Rock Castle County schools are now installing stop arm cameras on school buses. WKYT's Grayson Passmore gives us a look at how these cameras work and the type of information they can catch. But here's the, the stop arm camera. When, when this is out and the lights are blinking, this is the camera and the camera will actually sense when drivers drive by here. As transportation director for Rock Castle County Schools, Ken Hopkins demonstrates. When a child needs to be picked up or dropped off, the lights start flashing and the stop sign comes out. And a car illegally passes the stop sign, the, the camera will trigger and it will record uh, the vehicle that passes and its quality is good enough that we can get a license plate as well. Rock Castle County students will soon be getting on and off of these buses and with the new safety measures in place, it's bus drivers who are feeling a lot of relief right now. To be able to actually prosecute these cases, we need this video evidence because if not, it's it's in essence our word against the driver's word. Back in 2022, school bus surveillance video showed a driver of an SUV nearly hitting a 14 year old Franklin County student. With the video evidence, a grand jury indicted the driver on three charges, including improper passing and wanton endangerment. While thankfully the student was physically okay, it's incidents like this one Hopkins hopes the stop arm cameras will catch and even prevent. When students are loading and unloading a school bus, that is the time that they are the most vulnerable. In Rockcastle County, Greason Passmore, WKYT. For now, the school system has four buses equipped with the cameras. They hope that uh, one day they will have enough funding for more. 